berries, um, blueberries in particular, are known to protect the liver from oxidation, from stress, inflammation, anti-inflammatory towards the liver. So those are just some of the foods, but uh, with our liver cleansing program, we suggest recipes where you combine all these foods into the program. And then we combine the herbs. And I've talked about this before, mega dose therapy, where you use a lot of herbs and you use a lot of foods and you use them in synergy. And it's when you combine all of these things together, your liver has no choice <laughs> but to heal. And of course, especially when you're using these foods and herbs, it's really important to go back and look at the list of toxins that we talked about in previous episodes. And you'll find there's this on the page as well, up above, is look at all the toxins and how you can avoid them. So you're doing two things. You're detoxing by avoiding the toxins and avoiding all the things that contribute to liver toxicity and build up. And on the other hand, you are healing with food and herbs. So you're detoxing and you're healing. And that's why I love the term detox and heal yourself. But to heal yourself, you need to do the nutritive stuff. And the nutritive stuff comes with the food and with the herbs. It's no good just detoxing and fasting. Well, it's, there's some good in it, but it's, it's nowhere near as good as using the medicinal food and the medicinal herbs.